everybody, it's Wellness Wednesday. My name's Janelle, and not only am I a holistic healthcare practitioner, but I am also a professional dancer. And each week, I'm here to give you some tips and tricks on how to take care of your mind, your body, and your spirit from a holistic healthcare approach. So today, let's take care of our feet. Our feet are so important. They are literally our understanding. <laughs> so one of the first things that I like to do in the morning is I like to take a ball or I like to take a foam roller or both if you have both. So you can take a ball and put it on the ground and then take your foot and just gently step on it. As so you can see, I'm kind of bending my knee and rocking forward. And then I just gently start to shift down my foot and I find those sweet spots. Oh my gosh, it feels so good. Now, first thing in the morning, if your foot is kind of tender, you can also just take the ball and roll it. Just roll it like this as such. And you wanna just, oh my gosh, it feels so good. This is just like super awesome self massage. So just roll it around, take a few minutes. You can also do this sitting in a chair. Just kind of see how I'm just gonna roll it around on my foot, get my foot nice and open. But now if you're doing it sitting in a chair, it's not gonna be as much pressure as if you were to do it standing up. So if I do it standing up and I just gently apply pressure down, I bend the knee, Again, without, for alignment purposes, I'm not letting the knee knock in, I'm not letting the knee roll out, I'm just letting it go right over the knee, over the ankle bone there, right there. So my knee and my ankle are pretty much in line. Again, it's not rolling in, it's not rolling out, and I'm just gently bending and applying pressure forward and gently bending. And this second leg, it can stand in place or just put it, put it where it's comfortable for you. So the body's standing up and just again, just gently applying pressure in those places that feel good. And if you wanna alternate that with rolling back and forth with the ball, that's totally fine too. But and once you finish, once you finish one foot, just stand and notice the difference from foot to foot. Oh my gosh, how does that feel? You sh the, foot, the foot that you just worked on, that you gave yourself that massage to, is gonna feel so open, it's gonna feel so grounded into the floor, you're gonna feel so elongated in your body and you're gonna feel like you're standing better. So that's why I love to do this first thing in the morning. So again, just with the ball here and I apply my foot onto it and I can just kind of shift forward, just gently rock over and gently rock over. And you can do this with any kind of ball. This is um, a firmer, firmer ball here, more like a, I guess a lacrosse ball. Anybody plays lacrosse, right? <laughs> I think this is a lacrosse ball. <laughs> so again, or you could do it with tennis balls. And then you can alternate that again with, with the rolling of the foot. Just keep the knees nice and soft, not knocking in. It's not opening up. It's not getting crazy in any kind of position there. So just let it roll around there. And do it, again, do it for as long as it feels good to you. If it feels good, just do it. So then the next thing that you might wanna do is try, if you have a foam roller, this is a little half size -y foam roller that I have. And it's kind of the same thing. If you have this, instead, you just might wanna take it and step and just kind of roll your foot over it. Lord, I wanna keep everything again nice and soft, just the same way that we talk about in Flexible Friday. I'm just letting my kind of muscles melt away from the bones. I'm doing the same thing here, where I'm just opening up the arches and letting it roll and giving myself that nice foot massage. So um, my personal preference is the ball because you can really get that pressure in to each spot in the foot. So maybe if you start here on the foot and then there and there and there and there or you start here and then move down 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 wherever you want you can go here and just move it around down 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 the foot and pressure and pressure and pressure and pressure and be patient with yourself as you do it and then roll 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 the foot like i said first thing in the morning when you get up just to get that the body moving get the circulation going and like i said creating that sense of balance in your body it's going to really open up the foot relax the muscles and you got to literally remember there's in, in acupuncture there's all sorts of points that correlate to our organs in our bodies so you're you're stimulating simultaneously your organs in your via your foot isn't that cool that's so awesome right so stimulate stimulate your kidneys stimulate your stomach so a great way to start out your morning Okay, so the next thing that I wanna um, share with you, again, as I um, had previously shared in a post that I am now a doTERRA 
wellness advocate. So every video I just want to be sharing with you also one essential oil that I really love to use. And if you are interested in doTERRA oils, feel free to DM me, message me, email me, um, and I can help you get set up with your essential oils if that's something that interests you in life. And no matter what brand you're using, um, I just want to encourage you to use a pharmaceutical grade oil, and that would be either doTERRA or Young Living. I'm not aware if there are other um, oils that are pharmaceutical grade, but these are the two best brands that I know of, and you can only order them from those companies directly. So um, I would just encourage you to, to utilize those in your life because essential oils are, um, are a really amazing um, piece of the puzzle of holistic living. So, so. The oil of the day is um, On Guard because this is probably my most used oil. It is an oil that you use to help support your immune system. And what I like to do is, this is um, doTERRA's roller bottles. And so you can literally just roll it anywhere on your body. And I roll it on my feet here, just as such, I rolly, rolly, rolly on the center of my foot. And then um, by doing that, it also forces me to give myself a little foot massage. So then I literally nurture myself. And I mean, what a great way to also start your day. I put, um, put this on guard, on guard um, roller bottle oil directly on the soles of my feet and you can put it in other places like on the back of your neck or on your chest or a little bit on your temples or your wrists or any if you do EFT any of that which I'll talk about in a later video but um, you can put it put it anywhere on your body because this is um, what's called a fractionated oil so it has um, the coconut fractionated coconut oil in it so it doesn't um, agitate your skin because certain essential oils can sometimes agitate your skin a little bit if you don't uh, mix it with carrier oil. Um, On Guard oil is a proprietary blend of clove, it has orange, it has cinnamon, it has eucalyptus, it has rosemary, helps for um, healthy lung function all around. It just, it fights off and wards off nasty bacterias and things like that. So it is a, um, a daily oil for me that I put on the soles of my feet every single day. And I just super love this oil. And I do feel that it helps to protect my body and um, my immune system against nasty viruses. So anyways, if you are interested in um, ordering some oils or you would um, like to be a part of the doTERRA uh, culture, please feel free to message me and happy wellness Wednesday. Grab a ball or get a foam roller and roll your feet. Good. Then essential oils, essential oil on the soles of the feet with foot massage. And literally I use the essential oils on a daily basis because it makes me massage my feet every single day. And who doesn't want a foot massage? And it's not like you can go out and get a foot massage every single day from somebody else. You gotta love yourself, it's love yourself, love yourself. Again, it's a piece of that puzzle. Loving yourself enough to take care of yourself on a daily basis. And starting with your understanding your feet, taking care of your feet. So happy Wellness Wednesday, everybody. Please take good care of your feet and I'll see you next Wellness Wednesday. Thanks everybody.